Hello YouTube, I'm Otto and welcome to Farming Simulator 22. Uh, we uh, are now just going to the month of uh, January. Because yeah, there's not much to do. It was already snowing in December and we have a full blanket of snow in this month. So that's already a good thing. We have our chickens over here. They're doing an excellent job. And yeah, we're having enough food, the breeding. So that, those are the good parts. Uh, in this episode, we're definitely going to expand the farm. Because, yeah, we just have the house. The chicken coop over there. And that's about it. We're going to see if we have any contracts for this. Otherwise, uh, we're just going to like start, start building and expanding a little bit. Or skipping up to the next month. So we're having a cultivated contract on field 45 uh, 20 and 25. I think we're going to do those. The plowing, the plowing ones ain't that well we can do them but yeah it's a horrible a horrible small plow so we're gonna skip those and we're gonna go to f we're gonna go uh, do the contracts of 45 and 10 and 25 on the cultivating we're gonna borrow the items of 25 and we're gonna accept the contract on 45 it's the same equipment so we're gonna start there we're gonna jump to this, to, uh, yeah, the tractor that's giving us for the contract. And we're gonna go to field 25. Well, there's no way to eat it, so that's a good thing. So, I'm gonna pick it up, and we're gonna be on the way. Okay, we just did a wheelie. Uh, yeah, field 25. Where is 25? Oh, we're lucky. Field 45, 25. It's close to each other, so... I'll see you at... Field 25. Or we're gonna do 45 first. Yeah, we're going to do 45 first. So yeah, we're driving in a John Deere. And we're going to cut through through uh, the town center or most of it. Or some of it. Just hoping it's not too slippery on the roads. Snowy. And yeah, it's nice. It's the first time I'm actually playing when I'm actually having snow on the map. It's awesome. But uh, the sun is going to come through later today, so it's probably going to melt also later. But for now, we can enjoy the snow. I was like thinking to um, to like put in one of the productions, just like something passive, like solar wind power. But yeah, they're kind of expensive, and the ones that are available ain't really worth it. We're gonna look for something else. Maybe oh, slippery. So yeah, nothing happened. We didn't crash into anything. Um, yeah, maybe we can do some bees. Later on. Would be great. Then we can have some honey to sell. Uh, where are we? I don't know. Stop, so I think this should be 45. And then from there we can go to 25, that's also really close. Yeah, we're gonna start here. John Deere. It's also the one I used in the uh, Farming Simulator 19, the 6230R. It's a good tractor. 
but personally to me it has one disadvantage and that's uh, you only have like normal or white tires with or without weights and yeah that's what I'm missing on the tractors of John Deere sometimes and those are like the narrow tires but anyway doesn't matter I'm gonna time lapse this and then we're gonna go to field 25 and then we're gonna do it all over again and then we're gonna start expanding the farm so I'll see you on the other side So the contract is finished on field 45. Uh, we're gonna continue. <coughs> sorry, to a uh, field uh, 25. And I was thinking it's something for the future, like I don't know how many episodes from now, but like not now, not the next five or ten episodes, uh, to maybe put up a uh, vineyard, because uh, that's one of the new that's one of the new productions uh, together with uh, olives I know we have a grape processing factory somewhere on the map here so we can use that one uh, for the oil factory we have to uh, build a new factory we could use those for the canola seeds we have but at the moment it's not really worth it to do it so I think for now we're gonna store the canola when we harvest so field 45 is done and um, field 25 is right up ahead um, so yeah we're definitely gonna do grapes so yeah we're gonna raise a vineyard and kind of looking already for a field that we can use like not too big but definitely one with like an angled side on it, like a field 25 
a 44. Those are the better ones to do it because our workers have problems with angled fields. And they don't do the vineyard either as far as I know. Maybe we can... Uh, do that. Those fields kind of having a use. At least for us. But uh, I'm gonna time lapse this also. And I'll see you all back on the other side. The contract is finished on field 25. Uh, we're gonna turn everything in and we're gonna get around uh, 10,000 euros in total from it. So let's see, those two are completed. So we're gonna collect and collect again. And uh, we're gonna go to the farm. To actually do something that's like way overdue. So we're in our building menu. Um, so let's see what we have. This one would actually be nice, but uh, yeah, we don't have enough money for that. It's like half a million. Maybe we have something similar. That's uh, this. Let's open on both sides. I think can't turn the camera god damn it so yeah we're gonna go for something cheap we don't have enough money for that one oh they're right did they raise the prices? Yeah, they did. So let's see. Oh, that's the back. Okay, that's the one we needed.
So I think that's about straight enough. Maybe we can move it a little bit closer to the street. No. This is gonna be as good as it's gonna get, so gonna take one of these. Too bad we can't like line them up together. Because it's so close, there's gonna be like a small gap in between. So we're gonna leave that one there for now. And we're gonna look if we can get some animals too. I really wanna go for the bees, and I'm thinking. What side are they flying in? I think that side. So yeah, we're gonna put the bees right here, right to our canola field. Or wouldn't it be better to maybe put them here? Hmm, no. Yes, no, no. We're gonna put them here. Right behind the concrete border. And you also need a space. Well, actually, we need a space to spawn pallets. So we can do that. Behind the uh, beehive. It's only costing 200 euros. Right there. And then we have 80,000 left. Oh, I also have like a few mods. Um, those are like bigger pallet places. Like bigger places to spawn pallets. But the thing is, uh, cause of uh, update 1.14 of the precision farming of uh, giants. We only can spawn 100 pallets. So there is the problem. Um, I hope they're gonna fix it soon. Because uh, we can, at the desktop, we can spawn 100. At the consoles, it's even worse. It's 50. So I'm really hoping they're going to fix that really soon. Because 100 pallets in this game, it's nothing. You're having your productions. You're having your animals that are spawning pallets. Bees spawn spawning pallets. Same thing goes for the sheep. It's a lot. If you're just like stacking up your pallets with eggs, you're already easy, easy hitting 20, 20 pallets from like one chicken coop. So if you're taking a second one wherever, you're, uh, you're stuck again just because of that. So that's not a good thing. But we're going to take another chick. No, we're not going to take another chicken coop. We're going to take one of the new productions. Uh, we're going to take... We're going to take our greenhouses, but I have to move some some equipment first. Do we have a weight in the front? No. We're going to take our fertilizer spreader. And we're going to already put it in the barn. We're going to leave our trailer right here with the chickens. And I'm gonna put that one in here. So it doesn't rust. It stays nice. Back to... Back to uh, our production for the farm. So yeah, we're having three green greenhouses, um, a small, a medium, and a big one. Um, I'm thinking we're gonna go straight for the big one, cause this is a big one. This is a small one. And this is like, yeah, the medium one or the in-betweener, so... It's just gonna be easier to put a big one there. Turn it around. 
We're gonna leave enough space for the chickens too. So we can uh, reach our eggs. And then we're gonna put it right here. We're gonna make it a little bit better too. Gonna do some painting. Is this the right color? I don't know. Yeah, I really don't use that one much, so. Where is it? Here. Is this the right one? Yes, so we're just gonna continue this. To here. I'm gonna go in between here too. So it's all nice and even. I'm gonna stay away from the chickens. And we're done here, I'm just hoping we didn't do too much damage to the chickens, and yeah, we kind of did, so... See if we can actually fix this. Okay, gonna put some grass over needed. And I think we're good. Let's see. Can fill it up with grass, but I don't know. I'm not happy. I'm not happy. This is gonna be better. It's better. That's it. Let's take that one. It's gonna be slightly better. Than what we have. Yeah. It's better than the tall grass. I'm just gonna take some concrete. No. This one. No. I think it's this one. Yes. It's that one. So, okay. Right here. Oh, spring. Just gonna go everywhere except the direction I wanna go. Okay, we're gonna stay a little bit away from the chicken coop. And that's gonna be it, I think. Yeah, for now we're gonna leave it like this. But, yeah, we now are in the need for some equipment too. Because we need water. Otherwise the plants will not grow. So I think we need a trailer, water trailer we can use or buy it's just gonna be a small one it's not gonna be a big one so i see you people back at the shop so here we are at the shop um, we are looking for a trailer to get water or to transport water more in the way so let's see we have dollies low loaders here? No, not here. Hmm. 
maybe in maybe in the animal tab. Yes. This is a trailer we can use. And we're gonna keep that one in mind. We're gonna check first if we have something in the discount tab. And we have. We have a lot. So this one is three. I think we're gonna take the ag ag the aggro mass. And then we can do a uh, uh, seeds. Um, yeah, then we can do uh, the corn, sunflowers, soybeans, beets, and cotton. It's only three meters wide, but our fields ain't that big, so we're gonna buy this one for sure too. We only need a hundred horsepower, so that's ideal. So we're gonna buy this. And we're also, yeah, buying the trailer, the water trailer. So the Joskin one, that's brand new. I'm gonna take the wider tires uh, cause it's easier to back it up. So yeah. In total, we spend it uh, around 50,000. There is only one thing that we're gonna do. And that's uh, paying off a little bit from the loan too. So, we're gonna pick that one up. Or tractor, we're abusing it. And... We're gonna take the trailer. If it wants to. And we're gonna fill it up too. I know there is a spot right over there, so you can actually back it up in there. Just gonna have to look. I think it's here. Yes, it's here. So we're gonna back it up. And filling up the trailer with water. So it's in, and we're filling it up. Yeah, the advantage of this cedar I didn't side yet, or actually the drill. Um, we can also fertilize it with it like straight away. So that's one of the other advantages we have. Okay, getting our water trailer out, and we're gonna go to the farm. So yeah, the farm already just changed a lot in this episode al alone. So we're gonna keep doing that, little by little. So we're gonna drop off the cedar, or we're gonna take it off. No, we're not gonna take it off first. Uh, we're Gonna fill it up with that pallet of seeds that we have left from uh, the first time we were actually seeding the harvest to seeding the... Uh, when we were seeding the canola and the barley. So we're gonna leave it in here. And then we're gonna put some water in our greenhouse. And now we have a second passive income. Yes, it does. How big is it? Around a third, so that's another two loads. Anyway, um, it's good enough for now to start. So we have uh, three products we can actually grow in here. We have uh, tomatoes, 
lettuce, strawberries. I'm thinking, if we can, to uh, grow some tomatoes and lettuce first. Or we can let all three grow. We're gonna let all three grow, just because we can. All three of them are growing. And I'm hoping we're gonna have ballots so showing up soon. Yeah, we're gonna take one more load of water. And I don't think that's gonna be it. Ooh, we took a little jump there. It's a tractor, another rally car. So, backing it up. Yeah, it takes a while to fill though. It's uh, seven and a half thousand liters, maybe 10. No, 7,300. Yeah, our little tractor is is suffering but we got it out kind of smooth so we're gonna head back to the farm and if your people actually liking the content the content please like and subscribe and don't forget to ring that notification bell so Yeah, I'm gonna end the episode here. I see you all back later in another episode. Bye for now.